So today we're reviewing the TechBean 12 megapixel HD game camera. So this comes well presented in a decent box. Uh, taking out the contents we have first of all warranty card and we have the instruction manual which is a decent 30 odd page manual covering in great detail all of the features and options in order to get this camera set up. And in the box as well we have the camera itself. So just before we look at the camera we've also got the TV out audio video cable. We have a strap for attaching the camera to a tree or other suitable objects that we can use the straps for. We'll see the mounts on the back of the camera for that in a moment. And we also have the mini USB to USB cable for connecting the camera to our laptop if we want to do it that way or we can use SD card so here we have the camera itself and you can see it's printed in this camouflage print you can see the sensors and camera and behind the top section is the night illumination and you can see on the back we've got mounts for attaching this to a tree or other post and then we've got two strong clips on the side Let me open that up we can see inside the screen sensing camera itself and the LEDs for the night light got controls here menu enter test mode off on and various navigation buttons we've also got on the side SD slot USB connector on the bottom we've got a jack for external 12 volt power supply and the TV out we've also got on the bottom the battery compartment which if we press the open button we can get to the battery compartment so we can run this off eight standard AA batteries so if we pop those batteries in I'm using non rechargeables good fit get all those batteries in there and that goes back into the base of the camera and while we've got the main cover open we can also insert a standard SD card it is recommended to use class 10 obviously if you're capturing video you don't want any jitter or buffer problems on your card so a good card I'm using a uh, SanDisk card and once we've done that we can actually put this into test mode so we can see the screen and we can also see the red light now the red light helps us when we're setting this up so that if you do movement the camera will tell you 
when it's seeing an object. So you can set up your trigger correctly and know that if something comes in front of it or near it, that's what's going to trigger it. A brilliant screen down the bottom for setting it up and you can get to all of your menu options through this screen. So if I press menu I can get through six pages of options including formatting the card, setting the clock and time, choosing the different modes of operation, setting digital zoom, image size, picture quality, video size, length of video and most importantly at the top the mode. So in mode you can choose whether to record simply a photograph, a video, time lapse so recording a photograph every few seconds or minutes, hybrid mode which will record a video and a photograph and motion detection uh, which is video but instead of using the sensor it uses changes in the picture that it captures to record. That's used for cold-blooded animals that aren't going to set off the uh, the PIR sensor. Equally with time-lapse if nothing's going to actually trigger it then time-lapse is your only way of continually recording and hoping that you capture something. There are many many settings to be uh, to be done in here and once you have everything set up you can then switch this into on mode, shut the cover up and then the camera will operate as and when it believes it sees motion and record photograph or video whichever you selected. As you can see it said down there taking so it's taken one photograph and you can then it's counting down it's taking another one. So once you have photographs taken with it you can take the SD card out, pop them into a laptop and get your images off that way or use the USB socket on the side. So an incredibly technically advanced device uh, and yeah if you want to capture animals, nature, uh, anything where it's not going to be easy to re take the photographs yourself or you can't be out all night. Ideal device for doing that. So that is again the TechBean 12 megapixel HD game camera.